Hello guys, this is Trevor Dunn, and today we are going to be continuing, um, Need to Speed the Run, um, so obviously we need to continue it. Sorry about the loading screen, but shit happens. Oh, I need that drink. <laughs> so, as you can see, I'm currently 175th uh, position. If you get that um, innuendo right there. <laughs> I would rather be 69th position. So here we can continue from yesterday. You saw this bit at the end of the last video. Basically, he's a knob that tries to take you out of the race because he knows you're good and because he's such a pussy and a penis and a dick and a cunt and a fanny. So, off we go. Straight back into the action. Now, this is a battle. Uh, if I remember rightly... Oh, God, Barney. If I remember, you just have to overtake the the next person until that timer at the top runs out. Yeah, see so hold you hold the lead is the main objective. And that is how you drift, Chinese. Defeated that opponent, now I've just got to catch up with the other one, which is somewhere. I think he randomly appears once you pass the checkpoint. Yeah, see, there he is. You can choose to drift. Or you can just try and get around the corner as quickly as possible by braking. But personally, I never brake. I, I, I just lose a lot more speed if I brake. Don't know why, just do. I mean, I can try it now. I mean, I guess that works quite well, but I just nearly went off the edge there, see? I'm out of my comfort zone a little bit. I brake a little bit, and then drift and then boost to Jesus, try and gain control which didn't really work that well I must admit that did go extremely badly so as long as you have the lead in these ones it's really fine to be honest oh god As you can tell, I'm, I'm slightly ruthless when it comes to need for speed. I don't really care if I knock over a sign or anything like that, but I don't really think anybody does. I don't know if I'd really call that ruthless, I don't know. Or just maybe not a careful driver as much as you could be. Now on this one, try and take the shortcut a lot quicker and it pretty much guarantees you to win really which is always good I don't think they've used this kind of race or need for speed this before so it's it's quite good to see new kinds of races I suppose supposed to the finish there we go not bad. <sighs> so, um, off we go. That time on that 
on the speedball is the time for the whole of the run so far. Just remember that. And we'll continue and see what's next. I honestly can't remember what's next. That little information bit at the bottom has just just realised uh or told uh, reminded me to tell you that um you only have a, a limited amount of resets. If you do it on very easy then um then you do kind of get a lot more than you would. So you don't really tend to use that many. Or I don't, really. It may look like I do, but I've only used a couple of things so far. Uh, it doesn't really matter anyway. Um, so I'll begin next stage now. I can't remember what this one's called. But I can remember a police thing. Oh, this is also where you meet the two women. Well, you've met one of them before. I think I went on about that in a previous video of Need to Speed the Run, Run Free. But. Um, yes, off we go. Um, we're getting quite close to Vegas now. Only 22 uh, positions to take until Vegas. So now we're going to Panamint Valley, I think that is. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, actually, no, it says Death Valley National Park. Um, so that's always fun. So off we go now in just a gain 10 positions kind of race. I believe this probably wasn't the best car to pick when I had the choice now. I would have been much better off with a, a Nissan or something, I believe, because this can get quite off road here, I think. So our Lamborghini isn't really going to fare too well off road which I should have really looked into but I just picked the card I wanted to as you can see it's, isn't amazing at off road and that hitting that car wasn't the best thing I could have done there but um, yeah this car was seriously not built for this kind of Race. Oh, buy me. Fuck off. I actually do like that car though. Camaro SS is a beastie car. Should have picked it at the start. Showcase its beastiness. Fuck off right now. Little gate old Porsche. Get a paint job, bitch. Ha! <laughs> I'm going this way. This shortcut will probably get you close to gaining a position. No, that was close. Might even gain you a position, I have no idea. I don't know why I haven't overtaken these already. I really, really don't. Bitch. How do I get a clean pass for that? Jesus Christ. My bad. Sorry if anyone religious just heard that. I'm very, very truly sorry. I, I meant no offence by it. Ah, 
And this is the fun bit. Boosting all the way. Oh, blimey. I also think there is another garage coming up soon. And I definitely am going to pick a tuner car. But actually, no, I might not. Because you also get a new car in Vegas. But for some reason, you seem to... If you, you get, like, the choice out of three cars. But you... If you go into like a garage after, you can always select the cars that you didn't pick as well. So it doesn't really matter which one you pick, really. Because you've unlocked them already. Which is retarded, I know. Spasticate you completely. And the next location is Junction Road. Death Valley National Park. I believe that means California, I don't know. It might not. And I've only used four resets since I started. I guess it isn't really that bad. Try and use as many, uh, as um, at least as you can. If you do have any speed to run, um, do comment and Tell me how far you've gotten, or how, yeah, how far you've got, and, um, and how many resets you used, and your time as well, because I honestly will try and beat that time. So you've got to be honest with me uh, on that bit. You can't just say, oh, I got to that time, and, n and that'll be true. Because I will try and do it, and that is a thingy right there. I managed to get in that. I am very, very shocked. And now I am going to pick a Nissan. Oh, which one? I'm definitely gonna pick this one. I'll buy like this one. This one looks better. Sad face. That's not that one. That's the wrong one. That is why, because they are both the same. Which means I can choose either one I like. Wow, I'm such a spaz. Um, I think I will choose this one actually. And there is only one colour because it is a signature edition. Um, we're coming up to the end of this video. Um, I will obviously continue this. I have been Trevor Dunn. Um, please subscribe. Uh, add me on Xbox Live if you if you want to. Sunburn forever. Though my connection is suddenly just really shitty because of fucking TiVo. What a load of bollocks. So I might not be able to reply as soon as I would like. But definitely do subscribe and comment, please. Um, also, feel free to check out Quick Don't Fall. Spell it with one L, uh, otherwise it doesn't come up. Or just... I've subscribed to him, so just uh, just go to his through mine if you want. Um, I will uh, see you next time, guys. This video should be up soon, and um, later. <laughs> there wasn't really anything else to add to that, really. Um, yeah, bye guys.